From massive ocean systems to smart little robots, these machines are cleaning our waters like never before. Welcome to Mighty Machines, where technology fights for a cleaner planet. They call it Jenny, and it's the giant vacuum cleaner of the sea, built to fight one of the planet's biggest problems, plastic pollution. Unlike small-scale solutions, this system is designed for open ocean cleanup on a massive scale. It starts with a U-shaped barrier stretching 800 meters wide, slowly dragged through the water by support vessels. Ocean currents push floating plastic into the system's funnel, where it's safely gathered without harming marine life. Once collected, the waste is lifted onto ships, sorted, and prepared for recycling. In just one mission, Jenny removed tens of thousands of kilograms of plastic from the Great Pacific Garbage Patch, proving that industrial engineering can be a weapon for environmental change. Tested, refined, and ready for more, Jenny is the first step toward restoring oceans for future generations. It looks small, but the sea bin is like a trash can with superpowers, working quietly in marinas to fight ocean pollution every single day. This floating skimmer is installed at the water's surface, where currents naturally carry in debris. Using a submersible pump, the sea bin creates a gentle flow of water, pulling in floating plastics, microfibers, oils, and even cigarette butts. The waste is caught in a removable filter bag, while clean water flows back out into the harbor. Each unit can capture up to 1.5 tons of debris a year, working 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. And because it's placed directly where human activity is highest, like docks and ports, it tackles plastic pollution at its source before it can spread into the open ocean. Simple, effective, and scalable, the Seabin is proof that big change can start small. Shaped like a futuristic vessel, the Manta is a floating factory dedicated to one mission, hunting ocean plastic at scale. This giant catamaran glides across polluted waters, scooping up waste with conveyor systems that act like mechanical jaws. As debris is brought on board, it's sorted by type, plastics, metals, and organic matter, ensuring efficient recycling. The Manta is powered by renewable energy sources, including solar panels, wind turbines, and onboard waste to energy conversion, making it nearly self-sufficient at sea. With the capacity to collect up to 3,000 tons of waste per year, it can operate close to coastlines where pollution is worst, from rivers to estuaries and beyond. More than just a ship, it's a mobile solution that turns collection into action, showing how engineering can take the fight to plastic before it drifts into the deep ocean. It may look like a floating raft, but Fred, the floating robot for eliminating debris, is a solar-powered warrior built to clean our seas. Designed by Clear Blue Sea, this autonomous vessel glides quietly across the water, using conveyor belts to scoop floating plastics and trash from the surface. FRED runs entirely on renewable solar energy, allowing it to operate for long hours without fuel or emissions. As debris is gathered, it's stored safely on board, keeping it from drifting back into the ecosystem. The robot is scalable meaning entire fleets of FRED units can work together to cover vast areas of polluted water. Built with lightweight, modular materials, it's easy to launch, maintain, and replicate. More than just a cleanup tool, FRED represents a vision for the future. With a goofy smile and googly eyes, mister, Trash Wheel may look like a cartoon character, but it's a serious machine tackling river pollution head-on. Stationed at the mouth of rivers, this solar-powered water wheel uses the natural flow of the current combined with solar panels to power its conveyor system. Floating debris, plastic bottles, styrofoam, and even tires 
is guided into the wheel's mouth, lifted onto the conveyor, and dumped into onboard dumpsters. Working 24-7, Mr. Trash Wheel has already removed hundreds of tons of trash before it could ever reach the ocean. What makes it unique is not just the technology, but the personality. Those famous eyes have turned it into a local hero, inspiring communities and educating people about clean waterways. Funny on the outside, fierce on the inside, mister. Trash Wheel is proof that even the quirkiest ideas can make a massive environmental impact. It's invisible, completely silent, and surprisingly simple, yet incredibly powerful. Known as the bubble barrier, this system creates an underwater wall of rising air that spreads across rivers like a hidden shield, just streams of bubbles forming a gentle but effective barrier. Installed diagonally across rivers and canals, it works by pumping air through a perforated pipe on the riverbed, creating a curtain of rising bubbles. As trash floats downstream, the bubbles push debris toward the surface and guide it sideways into collection systems, without blocking boats or harming fish. Bigger, faster and stronger, System 03 is the ocean cleanup's most advanced weapon yet in the fight against plastic pollution. Nicknamed the Mega Cleanup Machine, it stretches nearly 2,500 meters long, three times larger than its predecessor, Jenny. Towed slowly through the Great Pacific Garbage Patch, its U-shaped design funnels massive amounts of floating debris into a retention zone where plastic is safely collected without harming marine life. The waste is then transferred to ships, sorted and recycled into new products. With its scale, System 03 can remove up to 10 times more plastic than earlier designs, making ocean cleanup more efficient and cost-effective. System 03 isn't just a machine, it's a giant leap toward cleaner oceans worldwide. Small, smart and unstoppable. The Jellyfish Bot is a robotic cleaner that glides across the water like its ocean namesake. Designed by IATIS, this compact vessel is built to tackle pollution in ports, marinas and harbors where waste often gathers. Guided by remote control or autonomous navigation, it moves silently across the surface, using its open mouth design to collect floating trash, oils and even microplastics. Despite its size, the Jellyfish Bot can work for hours, powered by clean electric batteries. Its modular design allows multiple bots to operate together, covering large areas with precision. Easy to deploy and maintain, it's already being used worldwide. Meet the Watermaster, the amphibious multi-purpose dredger that works where other machines can't. Built to operate both on land and in water, it's the ultimate all-in-one solution for cleaning rivers, lakes, and coastal zones. The process begins with its powerful excavator arm, which removes silt, weeds, and debris directly from the waterbed. Next, its pumping system can suction contaminated sediment and pump it safely to shore for treatment. With extendable stabilizers, the Watermaster remains steady even in rough conditions, ensuring precise and efficient work. This machine isn't just about dredging, it can also cut aquatic vegetation, restore shorelines and deepen waterways, making it a true multitasker. Designed for portability, it can travel on roads, launch itself into water, and get to work without the need for extra equipment. When it comes to cleaning waterways on a massive scale, Cleantech Infra Machines are built to deliver power, precision, and efficiency. These aquatic workhorses are specially designed to tackle floating waste, silt, and weeds in rivers, lakes, and canals. The process begins with wide collection conveyors that scoop up floating debris directly from the water's surface. The waste is lifted on board and stored securely until it can be offloaded for safe disposal. 
For tougher jobs, Cleantech Infra machines are equipped with powerful dredging and weed cutting attachments, restoring flow in clogged waterways. Built with high capacity engines and rugged designs, they can operate continuously, even in challenging conditions. Deployed across cities and industrial hubs, they help maintain cleaner, healthier water bodies while reducing environmental damage. Fast and efficient, the Four Ocean Mobile Skimmer is built to clean coastlines, rivers and harbors where plastic pollution gathers. Working like a floating garbage truck, its wide skimming conveyor collects bottles, bags and even microplastics, loading them into onboard bins. Powered by fuel-efficient engines, it can operate for hours, covering large areas in one mission. Once filled, the waste is offloaded onshore for recycling, turning trash into new products. Scalable and versatile, fleets of skimmers can work together to protect marine life and keep waters clean. It flies, it floats, and it fights pollution. The AquaDrone G1 and AquaPod are futuristic solutions by Clean Sea Solutions, built to protect our waters. The AquaDrone G1 is a remote-controlled surface skimmer designed to glide across harbors, lakes, and rivers, collecting floating plastics and oil slicks with speed and precision. Its compact design makes it easy to deploy in tight spaces where larger vessels can't reach. Supporting it is the Aquapod, a floating waste collection unit that stores the debris gathered by the drone, keeping cleanup efficient and continuous. Powered by electric propulsion, both systems are silent, emission-free, and safe for marine life. Shaped like a mini catamaran, the Waste Shark is one of the smartest and cleanest solutions for tackling water pollution. Built by Ran Marine, this autonomous surface vessel silently glides across rivers, lakes, and harbors, scooping floating trash, plastics, and even micro waste into its open mouth. Compact but powerful, it can collect up to 500 kilograms of debris in a single day, all while running on clean electric power. Waste Shark can be piloted remotely or operate autonomously, mapping waterways as it works and gathering valuable data on water quality. Safe for fish and powered with zero emissions, it's designed to run for hours without disturbing marine life. Deployed in fleets, these robotic cleaners can cover large areas, making them a scalable solution to a global problem. Stopping plastic before it ever reaches the ocean. That's the mission of the Ocean Cleanup Interceptor 006, one of the most advanced river cleaning machines in the world. Designed as a fully autonomous vessel, it uses the natural flow of the river to guide trash onto its wide conveyor belt. The debris is lifted from the water and deposited into onboard dumpsters, each capable of holding 50 cubic meters of waste. Powered by solar energy, the interceptor can work day and night without fuel, operating silently and emission-free. Once full, the dumpsters are detached and taken ashore for proper disposal and recycling, while the interceptor continues its mission. At busy ports and marinas where plastic and debris collect the most, the Four Ocean Harbor Skimmer is on constant duty. Installed along docks, it works like a floating vacuum, pulling in trash, oil, and microplastics from the surface. Inside, debris is trapped in large collection bins while clean water flows back into the harbor. Running 24-7, it prevents waste from drifting out to sea and harming marine life. Compact, efficient, and scalable, the Harbor Skimmer is proof that even in the busiest waterways, technology can keep our oceans cleaner, one harbor at a time.
The fight for cleaner oceans doesn't stop here. Discover more amazing innovations in our other videos. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to Mighty Machines for more engineering that makes a difference.